Hey folks, Joey Kasimi here with the Incompressed blog and this is another super quick tutorial. Now in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to install a WordPress blog in your Bluehost hosting account. Now I really wanted to make this video here particularly because Bluehost has a totally different way to install WordPress than what you may be used to with places like or companies like HostGator, JustHost or any of those uh, places like that. Because those hosting companies they use this tool called or simple script called Fantastico and Bluehost doesn't have that. They actually have a simple script that's actually called WordPress. So I'm going to show you how to do that real quick. It, should, it only takes like a minute or two to do it and actually I really like the way Bluehost uh, does it. It's really fast and easy to do. So right here I'm in the in my cPanel account in the back office of my Bluehost account and yours may look different and may be in different orders. I just like to arrange mine in what I use most, most which is files, mail, uh, software, domains, and databases and stuff like that, right? So what you want to look for is the one that says software and services, okay? So you go in there, just open that tab up, and you look for WordPress. This is the one you want here. Just go ahead and click on that. It's going to take you to this page, and all you're going to do is just scroll down here and click on this install button right here. Then it's going to take you to the settings page and right here if you only have one domain then you'll only see your main domain there. If you have multiple domains like I do you'll be able to scroll down and choose your domain. So I'm going to go ahead and choose uh, this one appendipity.com. Uh, one real quick note guys if you want to use a subdomain like yourdomain.com forward slash a blog you would type it in here and that's where your WordPress will be installed I like to go ahead and install it on the main domain so I'm gonna go ahead and do that right here in step 2 guys very important you're gonna to wanna to do this so just click here to display right here name your blog um, I'm gonna call mine's app and app and dipity right down here your admin you'll you're going to want to choose your own username and password you don't want to just leave it as admin Okay, one, three, I'm gonna go right here, Joy Kissimmee, and testing, one, two, three, four. Obviously, guys, that's just a test password. I will change it later. Uh, right here, you wanna leave this checked off, automatically create a new database, so you don't wanna mess with that. Right down here, just leave that there as it is. Down here, just go ahead on step four, uh, agree to the terms and conditions, click on complete. And right now it's starting to install your WordPress blog into your domain. And as you'll see, it's going to go really, really fast here. It takes just a few seconds to do. And that's it right there. As you can see, it took about, what, like 10 seconds, I think it took to install the whole thing. Uh, you could go check out your website right there to make sure that everything's working fine and dandy. And there you see, I have a WordPress installed. It didn't take too long, probably less than a minute to do everything. And that's pretty much it. Now it's uh, just time to go ahead and, and install some plugins and whip this baby up and make it look good. And I'll talk more about that on another video. So with that said, this is Joey Kasimi with another super quick video tutorial. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Peace. I love you for free. Out.